I'm a huge fan of this piece of equipment right here. There is no such thing as resistance to a vacuum cleaner or a better sound of a cockroach going down the tube. Using a HEPA filter vacuum is extremely important because the shedded skins or cast skins of the German cockroaches can cause breathing issues and possibly asthma. When you use a backpack vacuum like this one, the concern I always hear in the field is about live cockroaches left over in the unit. But when you actually inspect the bag that catches all the debris, you'll be lucky to find a live cockroach in this unit. Using a dust product to treat voids where German cockroaches are harboring is a great tool, but you really need to know proper dusting techniques. There's two common types of dusters that pest control operators use, a bellows duster and a bulb duster. To avoid clogging, never fill your duster more than halfway full. And I always like to put something solid in the duster, like a marble or something else, to help mix the product before application. Hold the bellows duster like this when dusting a void. When using a bulb duster, make sure the bulb is below the application site when treating. When you've used proper dusting techniques, visually you should see small quantities of dust. A large amount of dust can be repellent to some insects. 